What if I told you that skipping breakfast could make you live longer and look younger? Science says it's true, let me explain. For decades we have been told that eating first thing in the morning is essential for good health. But new research is flipping that idea upside down. Intermittent fasting isn't just a trend, it's the way to heal your body, boost your energy and even slow down aging. And the best part, it's simpler than you think. Hi. My name is David and welcome to my channel. In this video you will learn why intermittent fasting is so important, why obesity in the US has doubled in just 42 years, what happens to your body when you stop eating every 3 hours and the biggest myth about fasting that no one talks about and why it matters now more than ever. If you enjoy content about health, nutrition and how to live better, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more video like this. Alright, let's get started. So, what's the real problem? Over the past few decades something has gone terribly wrong with our health. In the 1970s the obesity rate in the United States was around 50%. Today it's over 40% and it's not just about weight. Along with obesity rates of type 2 diabetes, heart disease, and even certain types of cancer have skyrocketed. So what happened? One major change was how often we eat. We were told that snack all day long, breakfast, snack, lunch, snack, dinner, snack. But eating every few hours keeps your insulin levels high. And when insulin is high all the time, your body can burn fat. Instead, you stay stuck in the fat storage mode. Over time, this leads to insulin resistance, a condition where your cells stop responding properly to insulin. Insulin resistance is the root cause of most modern disease, including obesity, diabetes, Alzheimer's, and heart disease. The truth is, our bodies were never designed to be fit all day every day. Our ancestors spent most of human history in the natural cycle of eating and fasting. Fasting isn't something extreme, it's actually how our biology was built to work. So what actually happens when you stop eating every 3 hours? First, your insulin level start to drop. And that's a good thing. Lower insulin means your body can finally switch from storing fat to burning fat for energy. You are literally turning yourself into fat burning machine. But that's just the beginning. Autophagy is like deep clean for your cells. While autophagy becomes more intense after longer fasting periods, Research shows that even shorter fast like 60 hours can start to trigger these beneficial processes. Think of it like giving your body a head start on cleaning, repairing and refreshing itself. Your cells repair themselves, your inflammation drops and even your brain starts working better. Studies have shown that fasting can boost your levels of human growth hormone, which helps burn fat, build muscle and slow down aging. Plus, fasting gives your digestive system a break, reducing bloating, improving gut health and helping your body detox naturally. And the best part? All of this starts happening when you simply give your body a longer break between meals. Let's talk about some biggest myth about fasting. Myth number one. During fasting you are starving. This is simple not the true. According to Dr. Jason Fung in his book The Complete Guide to Fasting, fasting is completely different from starving. Starvation happens when you don't have access to food. Fasting is a choice. Your body has plenty of energy stored as fat and it simply switches to burning it. Hunger actually decreases over time during a fast as your body adapts. Meat number two. During fasting you burn muscles. Again, not the true. Dr. Fung explains that the body only started breaking down muscle if your body fat drops below 4%. For comparison, elite marathon runners usually have about 8% body fat. That means if you have fat to burn, your body will always prefer to burn fat before touching muscle. Meat number 3. Fasting leads to overeating. In reality, most people find they naturally eat less after fasting. Your hunger hormones like ghrelin actually stabilize with regular fasting and you become more in the tune with real hunger signals. You don't binge, you eat more mindfully. Meat number 4. Fasting deprives your body of nutrition. Not true if you are eating balanced, nutrient-dense meals during your eating window. When you fast, you are giving your body a break, not depriving it. In fact, fasting improves nutrition absorption when you do eat, making your body even more efficient. So to sum it all up, intermittent fasting isn't just about starving yourself. It's about working with your body's natural biology to burn fat, heal and thrive. Even a simple 16-8 fasting routine can make 
a huge difference in your energy, focus and overall health. If you found this video helpful, please give it the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more tips on how to take control of your health and live your best life. And let me know in the comments, have you ever tried intermittent fasting or are you thinking about starting? Thanks so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.